it is time to share something cool from the smorgasbord of social media. Smorgasbord is a weird word. This is what I'm liking. All right, it seems like now, even more than he was alive, the world is obsessed with Bob Ross and those trees. Um, well, I've discovered an artist who's just as talented, just as positive, and who has a voice just as soothing as Mr. Ross. Not only does this guy paint spectacular landscapes, I mean, incredible landscapes, he showcases his work in the wild and it's like a part of the whole experience. So he photographs his finished canvases right in the middle of the terrain where he is painting them. All right, he's Bob Ross 2.0, and he's zooming in right now from Montana. Um, what's up, Aaron? How you doing? I'm doing great, thanks. Thanks for having me on. So tell us about the painting outside. Is it, is it your artistic passion, right? Like painting outside, just that being a part of it? Absolutely. Um, it's just where I feel most alive, painting outside. And I just, I love the unpredictability of it. You know, you just, you head out and you never know what you're going to get. And sometimes it doesn't work out. Mm -hmm. um, but when it does, you know, it's, it's, it's reactive, it's improvisational, and it, and it just feels true. So what, what made you decide to share your paintings, like, in the wild on Instagram? Um, I, you know, it's one of those things I sort of stumbled um, on. Um, I think I did my first, I, I just call them easel shots, you know, just um, where I, photograph the painting in the landscape so it almost looks like a, a window on, onto the broader landscape. I think I, I remember I did another one in Maui and put it on, uh, at that point it was just Facebook and it just sort of took off and then when Instagram happened I just started to do them more intentionally um, mm -hmm. when I have the chance to, when it works out and it's just astounded me the kind of reaction that I've gotten to these things, uh, to these, these pictures. Mm -hmm. To me, it's a way of bringing people with me, you know, bringing people into the field, letting them be a part of the process, letting them see the context that the artist created in. Um, so it's well, a way I think you're right. Not everybody gets to see that kind of beauty, like, and that, that Montana has, and that kind of um, isolation in a good way. You're not so, you know, we're not so surrounded. It's not always so right. busy. It's not, it's just as beautiful and it's still. And, and I do think that that's what your paintings do. It brings you to that moment. And I think that you are extremely talented and i i was excited to have you on the show and um aaron thank you so much for sharing the paintings and please keep doing it um, especially now more than ever we need that kind of hope and beauty um and i'm liking your posts right now okay all right thank you so much all right subscribe to my channel subscribe to my channel subscribe to my channel subscribe to my channel please don't make me keep going